Hi, my name is Dex from My Consult, and since 2003, we have been helping business owners simplify their accounting processes. So what happened is we actually started this channel so that we can even help more people using their accounting system more effectively. And if you like what we are doing right now, do like and subscribe to support us today. Alright, so in today's video, we'll be looking into one of the new features in AutoCom version 2 that is called the template function. The function is actually available in every single entry screen in your AutoCom system. So for today, we're going to use quotation as a sample. You can come here to quotation. Okay, so normally for me, when I recommend clients to use this, uh, it's usually for clients that prepare similar quotation to different clients. All right, so this function can actually help you simplify and quicken your quotation preparation type. So let's say I prepare a quotation. So let's say I press testing, send your hat, and I will select an item. So I can select, uh, I'll say autocom basic. Then I can even select additional items. So I can say maybe testing item and maybe I want to add one more item here and I can say, okay, program number. Okay, and I can put in the price, say example 5,000 and this is 1,200. Okay, so when what happens is this quotation is something that I will prepare for different clients. So what happens is here, before we actually press the save button here, we have one called save as template. So click save as template. So we can say this is the auto count basic template. Okay. So once you be done, press OK. Then you can actually save your quotation already. So let's say today now I want to prepare another quotation to another customer. So all I just need to do is I come here to quotation. Click here. So now you can see there's a different template. A blank template means it's an empty one and the AutoCom basic template would comprise of the items I choose. So let's say I select here. All the items will then appear again. So then all I just need to do is I need to change my supplier. Say example here. And then yes. And all the products will come out again. So once we're done, we press save and the quotation is prepared. Right, so this feature is not only limited to quotations, it's also available in fields like or screens like the journal entry. So you click journal entry, there's a save as template. So this for depreciation, for provisions, for salary accruals, this is very helpful. Or even for your cash flow entry. So when I press cash flow entry, I press new payment voucher. We also have a thing called save as template. All right. Um, apart from that, uh, this process can be also done in your purchase order quotations as well and also for your AR invoice, AP invoices. All right. So with this, now you can actually simplify your processing inside AutoCount. If you have any guides you would like us to cover, leave a comment below. Thanks.